How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another video on channel. Today I'm at St James' Park, Newcastle. They face Cambridge in the FA Cup third round. It's a massive game for Cambridge, the biggest game of the season. The richest club in the world versus Cambridge United, where we saw them earlier on in the season playing the likes of Arrington, Stanley, Plymouth and all that. It's going to be crazy. Let's get in there and see if we can cause an upset for the Cambridge boys beating Newcastle. From Arrington Stanley to Newcastle boys in a season, uh, what's all that about then? Two months ago we were in the away end at Morecambe with 90 fans. There's 5,000 Cambridge fans, it's going to be absolutely insane. Like, it's just ridiculous how you can go from Arrington Stanley in the season to Morecambe and now in an FA Cup they've got like the biggest day of the season this year so far against Newcastle at St James's Park. Going to be huge, a sellout. can't wait. Kira mate, are you excited for today mate? Absolutely buzzing. We've got to get you a Greg's though, haven't we? 10 donuts you probably. 10 donuts, might have to be 12 mate, now I'm here in person I'm buzzing Come for it. On! We talk about going through turnstiles in our lives. Kieran, mate, um, what's that? No, not good, is it? <laughs> It's not looking good, is it, mate? It's a sticky situation, boys. Right, Freddie, we're here in Newcastle. What's your prediction yeah. today, mate? Um, if I'm being real optimistic, I'm going to say 1 0 Cambridge. Uh, Imagine that. I'm just happy to be here, so if it's 3 1 Newcastle. Exactly, it's just really for the occasion, isn't it? What's the prediction today, mate? Come on, tell me. 2 0 Cambridge. <laughs> Newcastle fans laughing to that one. Here we go, then, the start of the journey. How long will this take us? Let's find out. Let's do the quads and show how much I've really eaten around Christmas. Is Thank God. It? I know my New Year's resolution to get fitter now. Jack Beaton, we're here, Newcastle away. What are you saying? Well, first of all, the way in stairs is like walking up to Mary's Church in Cambridge. It's painful. It is, mate. Like Done my quads in, I can't lie, but what's, what's the score, mate? We'll go 3-1 loss. 3-1 loss? No, that's realistic, isn't it? Realistic. 2 on Cambridge. Uh, oh. How someone could change a prediction in two seconds, I don't know. Two but hey, here's Kieran. Beaten sheet. Oh, no. This is why Kieran's an absolute hero for the channel, mate. He brings props like this into the ground. For the big occasion today, we need to have a nice welcome when the players get onto the field. We've got... Yellow and black balloons, And we've arrived at Newcastle United. I kind of forgot, I've been here before and I've forgotten how huge this stadium is. A bit different to Accrington. Um, I know I've said it quite a lot already, but I'll tell you what, it's a little bit different. You've been National League, you've been everywhere, mate. But now you're at Newcastle United, how does it feel, mate? Mate, honestly, it feels amazing. Like, come on, I mean, look at the view. The view is just for crazy, isn't it? It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. Like, we are so small, a small club. Like, and bringing 5,000 fans. Exactly. That's amazing. That yeah. is something amazing. And what's the score going to be today, mate? Honestly, I'm going to go for a 3 2. Not yes. Come on, mate. lads! And here's the Cambridge team. That was St. James's Park. Oh, 
giant purple team! Here comes Danger, Maximan, cuts in, Jonathan. That's the worst position you could give it away for Newcastle, and it's a save. Oh no. Oh, what a tackle! What a tackle for Ida! That is some tackle! United nil, big second half, which is going to go soon to maintain the effort and passion and desire. Cambridge showed that first half was going to be difficult, but I tell you what, they finished the game nil nil. Johnny takes the time, what a result that will be for them. Yeah! He's offside! He's offside! I thought so, the line now, right? a little so offside. There's a good finish in all fairness. But hey, it's still nil nil. Oh! No! Off the line! Yeah. Glasses again, he's got to be onside. I swear it was.
Understandably, keepers going up too. Oh no, oh no. Save! What a save! Bit off again! Bit off! This could be a 1 0 Cambridge away at St James's Park, Newcastle, United in the Premier League. The richest club in the world. This is where they could see them. In the FA Cup third round. Look how much it means! Look how much it means to them! How much it means to everyone here. I can't believe it. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe what I've seen. I simply cannot believe it. Wow. Wow. Look how much it means this Cambridge squad. League One, they've just been promoted. And a beaten Premier League Richard side, Newcastle. Wow. Look how much it means to them! Oh my god! Oh, this is incredible! Travel all the way up to Newcastle for this memorable FA Cup third round victory against the richest club in the world. A 
and all the Newcastle fans, they're out, they're out. This is about 10, 15, 20 minutes after the full-time whistle now. 25 minutes after the game, they're all sat down, just sitting down, watching the Cambridge fans celebrate and just enjoying the moment. And so they should. They're just beating the richest club in the world. And I will repeat that again. The whole stadium is cleared. Absolutely not one Newcastle fan in sight. But you still got 5,000 Cambridge fans here. You still got him here. Wow, wow, wow. Well, I'm back from Newcastle. I'm, at, I'm actually at Stansted. It's, what was it, 20 to 1 a.m. in the morning. Got to be up for about 6, 4 and 8 a.m. Flight to Milan to go to watch Lazio versus Inter Milan at San Siro. But it was all about the Newcastle game. What a fantastic atmosphere all game. What a win. What an absolute shock. And this is the magic of the FA Cup. Cambridge United going away to St. James's Park, the richest club in the world. Newly promoted to League One this season. And they've just smashed... Newcastle out of the park with a 1 0 win from Joey, Joey Ironside. Like, just what, what on earth was going on in that game? The atmosphere, the occasion was fantastic, and I'm so glad and happy for all the Cambridge fans who made a journey. And just in general, Cambridge is a fantastic, friendly club with amazing fans and bringing 5,000 fans up to St. James's Park. Well, that's a memory you'll never forget in your life, being a fan for that club. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like, share out to as many people as possible, because this was just incredible. And fair play and shout out to all the Newcastle fans, because every single Newcastle fan I met, apart from some youngsters who decided that they wanted to just spit on the back of my leg. Um, yeah, yeah, cheers for that, lads. Yeah, you were all so nice, really welcoming, and I'll tell you what, you're really respectful for the loss you took, but the respectful Newcastle fans who came up to the Cambridge fans after the game and given us all the congratulations. I'll tell you what, that was really, really welcoming and really, really um, respectful, in my opinion. So, so really respect to Newcastle fans. You're very nice. And just Newcastle people in general. Sorry for the voice break. Just very, very nice. But if you enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Share the video around because this one was just insane. Incredible limbs and incredible day out with my friends and my mates at Cambridge. An absolute shock and the magic of the FA Cup. Hopefully see you in the next round, whoever Cambridge play. And I'll see you guys later. Goodbye, guys.